Our guest today is a hustler who, despite life-changing physical setback, broke every barrier to become the president's official DJ. Welcome to Tuzidi Na Hustle, a show that highlights young Kenyan entrepreneurs through their losses, lessons, and wins. I'm your host, Martin Kimathi. Well, that was an introduction. Majina Kamili. Majina ID. Ignatius Ogeto. That's a DJ euphoric in the Patu actually in a brother. It's an English word in a man, something in a pressure masculine. Mm -hmm. yeah, so they couldn't see. Okay. So I had to remove it and then make a QUE. Make it cool. artist too, man. Yeah. yeah man. Why did you get into DJing? Um, my passion. Mm -hmm. It was my passion. Niki, niki grow before ni end up in wheelchair nilikuwa na hiyo passion ya muziki DJ so nilikuwa na watch sana mm. eh wasi kuna kuna DJ Adrian yeah hata even before tupeleka DJ yeah. Adrian i need to understand before even cuz uh, you said before kwa kwa wheelchair you already had the passion but what happened that led you kwa kwa wheelchair so i was born well uh, at the age of uh, 16 17 mm. that's when niliamka asubuhi moja so mimi nika feel pain kwa joints unaona so i mean ka ignore unajua hiyo age ni ile unacheza futa na vitu mm. vingi unacheki so nika ika kwa like ah, jana nilianguka unaona ni just minor pain so mimi nikaendelea so as days goes by your pain can increase so when you neglect please to increase then you don't need my power aje kuna vile nasikia uchungu then now akasema acha tuende usi so tulienda usi Osi hizo test zote walifanya hakuna kitu ilikuwa inapatikana. So nilikuwa naambiwa manzi msi uko sawa. How did you manage just to adapt being confined on all the level on the Actually ilikuwa ni hard sana because the society jakupatia that support you see. So it's something wao wa accept. So for me ilikuwa ni hard sana. Juu nilitengwa. So hiyo pia kutengwa it add for me like it took me like 2 years and then you adapt so uh need to lose friends so the only people when you are standing I mean my parents and my siblings my brother and my sisters my parents actually will go and be sana you you can be a testimony you can change someone's life if you accept so i had to accept the idea ya kuwa dj so nilikuwa na watching before hata nianze kutumia wheelchair nilikuwa na watching sana DJ Adrian. Mm. Eh, hey, uh, my pioneers of the industry. Man. <laughs> so, nilikuwa na watch na watch sana. Alafu kitu funny, tulikuwa mm. bado tuna 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 social media. So, nilikuwa na texting na alikuwa na reply. Wow. Of which I says you wonga. Yeah, like hata akiwa Kenya na niambia ni aje uko area, ni aje can meet up. And you told your parents na reaction yao ilikuwa ngaje? So, I told my parents a uh, nina nataka kufanya DJ so my parents were like <laughs> so hiyo ni nini unatuambia nini unaona um alafu hii period ya mimi ku, ku life yangu ku change ndio kuingia kwa disability mm. i think my, my parents pia wali adapt mm -hmm. like we can't do anything let's like support him unaona so walikuwa always there so niliwaambia so nilikuwa naongoja tu ile time yenye Edna nataka mkoa TV Wow. Then na waita naombe una check hiyo kitu msa anafanya. Hiyo ni hiyo kitu hiyo dia DJ. Mimi nataka kufanya. You see? So hapo sasa wakaniambia okay kama hiyo unataka kufanya then hiyo ufanywaje? Mm. So I to now nikaanza ku kutafuta social media like DJ academies. Oh. So that ya. was the next move at least now. Okay. Si sasa wame accept. Yeah, unakupatia baraka so, yao. Eh, mm. So then uh, watu wanaenda shule nikamwambia watu wanaenda watu wanaenda kwa academy wana yeah. wana go through the, the session ya kukuwa DJ so akaniambia sasa watafuta so nika nza kutafuta DJ academy zote nilipata anga zilikuwa anga first second third floor huko na hakuna lift wow. eh yeah, iko accessible so yenye nilipata yenye ilikuwa accessible actually mse aliniambia anga DJ wa hapo hivyo aliniambia anga tujai deal na mse kwa wheelchair so it's a no so nikakuja nikakutana na boy wangu fulani mm. my home boy akaniambia bujaribu hii spin trade academy. Mm. So nika ingia social bado nika text huko nikaambia huyu mzee niaje nimekuwa referred hapa na Viki na nime mimi niko kwa wheelchair na ningependa kufanya. Mm. So akaniambia wewe kuja usiwe na wasiwasi. 
So mimi nika plan, nika ndogo. Kufika hapo kwa hiyo building, yeah. lift imeanza fast floor. Uh, <laughs> Kutoka huko ground the stairs. The stairs. So mimi nimefika kwa ile mpiga heli. Vipi bana? Niko hapa chini na nacheki lift. So akaniambia acha nika so akakuja akaniambia kade mko hapa first floor mm. lakini acha nene nika mm. acha nene nika so akaenda akakama akakama na wase wanne au wase walikuwa wananibebanga for 3 months from ground to first ni gonga every day monday to friday ni gonga every day ya kwanza gigi ya kwanza so gigi Ika ya kwanza ili ili kwa hivi um kuna kwanga na international day ya persons with disability mm. it's an it's a un thing eh So nikasikia eh kuna hiyo day yetu nikasema si mimi ni mtu wa nikana disability mm-hmm. so nikasema eh acha nijipeleke huko so mimi nikajipeleka huko nikamwambia ase nimesikia 3 December kuna hii day ni ya disability na mimi ni DJ na mimi staki mwili unilipe so i told the guy lee niaje kuna hii gig nimeangukia <laughs> so lee akaniambia chukua diski yangu na laptop So mimi nimeenda gig tumefika ilikuwa KICC nimefika huko asubuhi hiyo event sasa ndo inaanza sound imesetiwa kila kitu so i met this guy big ted so big ted alikuwa mc event ikaanza mm-hmm. when event ilianza mimi mm-hmm. ka do my best mhm kamaliza venye tulimaliza wale wasee wa kansu wale walikuwa na organize Eh wali nitoka kaniambia mazi good job. Wow. So they gave me 15 Gs. Kaniambia ndio transport. <laughs> And you had no anticipation of. Mazi mimi nilikuwa nimemaliza nimetoka hapo nimesema eh alafu feedback nilipata ilikuwa ili nipatia tu eh hii kitu ni yeah. real. Now from getting good feedback you know all the applause and everything. How do you so how did you manage to get from there to the first thing gig? Ili come from the previous gig kuna kuna wase walikuwa na sponsor the, the part of the sponsorship so uh, the, the UN event uh. so ndio walinipigia simu na niambia unakumbuka ile event ya KCC sisi tulikuwa kama sponsors uh. and uh, tulipenda what you do na tuko na gig tungependa ukamova your time had you come up with a red card so unajua a be charging Azi. specific amount mimi bado nilikuwa na consult ah mm. lakini hii ya sasa second gig yeah already waliniambia budget yetu ni ah so it was already an assured budget eh alafu uh. ilikuwa a bit kitu poa na ndo unaanza uh. 40g <laughs> zero ay 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 ini laptop ini unacheki yeah yani uko ushazipangia so kwa hiyo kwa hiyo kwa hiyo event mm-hmm. nika met daddy owen naona mm-hmm. sasa tuna so network in expand in expand mm-hmm. yeah so daddy owen actually alikuwa na perform so mimi kwa dj ongea hakukuwa na watu wengi pia because ilikuwa ni in, kind of an in house mm. eh so tukachin contact na radio and so ile square event tukakuja tukafanya hiyo event ikakuwa fit mm-hmm. eh wadosi wenyewe kwa hiyo company wakafurahi wakasema hey, it, it's a good uh, talent tungependa kugrow naye so hivyo hivyo ikaanza kufanya pia event zao Mm. So hapa nimekutana na Radio N. Na Radio N tumebadilisha contact. Eh nimechill Radio N anampigia simu niaje kuna song nimefanya nataka ukam kam through tufanye video. Song ni vanity. Oh, oh ni vanity. Ndio hiyo sasa. Yeah. So mimi kwanga huko lakini nilikwanga mwoga. Eh kama nimechiki ni legacy. Umechiki eh? So uh, kwa, kwa vanity tukaenda tuka shoot. So kutoka hapo hiyo ngoma ikamaliza kila kitu ile time sasa kulonchiwa akaniambia ni ajili ngoma tuna launch. So nataka ukamkani. So kufika hivi nikakutana bado na Big Ted. Bado ni MC hapo. Unacheki. <laughs> <laughs> so mimi nikaingia juu. Oh, nilikuwa amenipatia VIP. Event ndio hiyo imeshika. So ime, ina, inaelekea. Okay. Kisha. Mm-hmm. So hapo pum la zile wanasema saa akuja akatekeki. Mm. So Big Ted akasema by the way before tukatekeki kuna msee hapa tumefanya na yeye amefanya na Owen na tungependa sana tumsupport mhm tumependa job yake so ni msee tungependa tusupport art yake so kidogo tu nikaambiwa roka huku juu so wasa wakakamu akanibebo akanipandisha stage so mimi sikuwa najua 
So hapo ndio sasa owe na dictated. Wakasema tumefanya na umsegi lakini ana machine. Unaona? Mm. Ya ku DJ. So tungependa tu ma artist. Msemo yako hapa na ana feel ku support. So within 15 minutes liko ame contribute up to 520,000. What? That was huge. Hey. Hey. Now getting your equipment to ambie how you managed just to come up with the pricing and um it was very beneficial because now we eliminate so many expenses and to anyone at the moment nataka kuanza how do you come up with the pricing uh coming up with the pricing ilikuwa um, ku consult unaona mm-hmm. uh nimekuwa msewa ku consult ni aje um, matume ka kwa industry sana acha hiki so msa kikwambia hivi na hivi let's say it's corporate let's say it's a wedding kitu kama hizo dina whatever unakamaje na so hiyo 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 consultation so ndio nilikuwa naambiwa ikiwa maybe the corporate uh, you start from this price and then pia watakwambia yao unaona then na mda mda agri amwezi kwa sana una cheki eh ka harusi msa nakwambia kona um harusi una cam reception eh tutoku huko by from 3 maybe watu walikuwa wameenda kupiga picha mm. kuja huko ni 3 from let's say from 2 ndio kuna wale wasio wako huko mm. up to maybe 6 mm. like 4 hours una ngapi mm. na cheki mm. kama hizo so ni ina depend ni nani una work now mm. yeah nice one now for dj euphoric hapa kwenye uko sai mm-hmm. um just tell us more about uh, the process and what is it that you do here nini inafanyika currently apart from just djing nini nyingine unafanya uh apart from kwa dj mm. uh apa we are part of uh, i'm part of production i'm here as a production manager so you the head of production uh, yeah so what we do uh, apart from at funny events the president am a state events whereby una checking most artists when they perform in presidential so lazima go through here so apart from that we also mentor mm-hmm. tuna mentor my youth tuna mentor wa say upcoming artists okay. eh, tuko na studio here okay. artist kama ni upcoming artists na una pesa ya record na song na nini unaweza tuandikia kwa sababu angalia hii camera vizuri acha niangalie camera tu vizuri mazee yeah. wasanii uko nje <laughs> So kama uko huko nje mazina wewe ni artist una pesa ya kurekord una feel uko na song kali na una pesa ya kurekord tuandikie tu permanent presidential music commission tafuta tuangalie tu kwa mitandao tutumie email tutumie message tutakujibu unatuambia song yako ni gani of course lazima ikuwe ni song poa song ya kuelimisha community si hizi song zingine So una tuandikia tutakupatia session ukuje u record for free. Yo so guys maze unataka kujele ngoma yenye prezo upenda sana. Stay up hivyo. Tunarudi kuicheza sai sai. Tuzidi na hustle. Previously on Tuzidi na hustle. Alafu ilikuwa a bit kitu poa. Na ndo unaanza. Forty G zero. Ay 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 ay. Ini laptop ini unacheki. Yeah. Yaani uko ushazipangia. So within 15 minutes liko ame contribute up to 520,000. What? That was huge. Hey. Ay. In your own words, mm-hmm. feature yako like what are your aspiration? For me, mm. nile mi feel mi 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 feature yangu nile ningependa yani nikiwa somewhere mm. then kuna mse like uh, kupitia mimi huo mse pia yako somewhere so future yangu iko ngile nasemanga mm. as in 10 years kutoka sasa nitakuwa niko na studio pigi sijui nini ah uh-uh. mi semanga mi mi future yangu ina depend inaenda move to to changing life Wow. Yeah. Eh, kwa sababu kuna kitu mimi ni drive. Kuna kitu mimi uji, ujiambianga lakini like, kiamka nasemanga let someone look at me and say because of me a close up. Mm. Mm-hmm. So let someone be 
kule anataka pia kukua because ya ile inspiration Mama. Nice. so mi future yangu ni to change yani nikiwa huko bado ndakuwa na nikuwe somewhere where by still i can change people's mind mm. mentality and stuff mm. yeah the future Ooh, that sounds like a bright future alafu if you know what you're about to do right now takunifunze ku dj yeah. in this amazing segment tunaitanga secure the bag okay sindio and for you at home if you don't know what secure the bag is all about it's where now after all the talk i get into work i fit uh, into what is it that you do to earn a living na leo nafunzwa kuwa dj nitaweza ama sitaweza unaona aje bro utaweza nitaweza yeah. but we will find out officially on secure the bag Euphoric, yep. I want you to take me through process kwa sababu unaona kuna ma there's so much going on here mm-hmm, man. Mm-hmm. So what does this do? What does this hii inafanya ngani? Ni just the basic kwanza. Okay. Mm-hmm. So sitaki nikwambie vitu vingi vichanganyikiwe. Ni kwanza nimeziangalia nimechanganyikiwa. Unaona hapa imeandikwa side A, side B. <laughs> so let's say kuna music inacheza in side A. Okay. You have to lazima zishikane na muziki the next song in una drop mm-hmm. from the other side. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. So kuna button hapa mbili tatu zenye nipoa kujua these are fader. Mhm. Hizi bado ni za kuwa mziki. Okay. Uh, we have a play the Q. Uh-huh. Uh, same applies the same the other side. Mhm. Alafu kitu kingine lazima uko unajua mziki yako poa. Okay. Ujue kick. Yeah. Where the I think hapo ndo kazi iko. Eh. Uh, Ukishajua vitu kama hizo. Mm-hmm. Then uh, BPM pia muhimu. BPM ni nini? Eh uh, beats per minute. Okay. Venye, venye zina flow. Juwezi yaka ngoma tuseme iko so beat uh, beats per minute yake ni so weke na ngoma iko 120. Ah. Uh, so that's why unapata ng um, lazima u, u grow ukicheza muziki lazima uanze na, na na BPM ya chini. Okay. Uki uki grow uki, ukienda ukipandisha hiyo tempo. Eh uh, ukipanda ukipandisha hiyo tempo. Hivyo hivyo mpaka uh. unafika kule unataka. So tutaanza sasa. So tunaanza eh? Yeah, tunaanza. Uh-huh. So hii inatumika anga ku scratch. Okay. This play now unaweza finya. So Shanza na timeless hapo. So So kuna hii side. Mhm. So ingoma lazima make sure Beat so ni kwa 110 110 yeah. beat per minute yeah. uh-huh. so una apply the same ulikuwa huko this are fader iko ile side so unaileta katikati so hapa katikati when we now transition to the second yeah. song yeah. Yeah. okay yeah. okay yeah. so nini yetu sasa ile za fader yetu iko katikati iko katikati mm-hmm. yeah. so usiguze ile so huko tumemalizana na tumemalizana na hii ndio mafans wanasikiza ah so msima dj tuko hii pande so lazima tuko hii side okay nashika okay So na kila ngoma lazima u drop kwa chorus. Aha. Kitu moja ya. So acha nikuonyeshe alafu. So how uh, do you drop? Dro- unaweza play. Uh-huh. Ama unaweza unaweza scratch uki uki drop. Uh, so uh-huh. So ndio your chorus. Your chorus. So, leo ya pili. Then. Mm. So in the meantime unaweza kuki scratch. Eh. Hey. Na uta kuile. So, uki uh, scratch. Lazima u scratch kwa hiyo kick. Oh. So the kick ni boom when the bass kwenye inaingia. Eh. Tin. Eh, so mato. Mhm. Sinisha kuonyesha basic. Yeah, umenyonyesha. Si ndio eh? Mhm. Sasa hebu wa nice wa say ni bambe watu bambo ase uh, acha acha ni DJ Martin kama they coming through acha ni toke ah. let me come lakini usiende mbali ah sieni mbali nime nimerudi sije ya red apo uta play Na hizo ngumbuke inaisha if I ishe Oh kwa nini nakata ku play Finya hiyo nyingine like this Okay <laughs> So 
todo de volume. <laughs> 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 okay, what is happening? So, I, so. It is and gentlemen. DJ Akasubana ka pigwa chupa. Je ni ni ma? Mbona muziki chezi? We. Sasa jiwe ni the presidential DJ maze. Nataka utwambie ni ngoma gani the president anapendanga sana because I want to queue in na hiyo. Yeah. Mr. President this is a dedication to you. Uh DJ Fori kapa hivi ataniambia ni gani and then you just take us your transition tutaingia. Please open ngoma gani? So kuna ngoma anapendanga hii uendanga ni pole pole. Ngoma uwe ndanga tu pole pole. I ni ngoma I think ana feel akisikianga kuna venye kuna venye inamjenga anapendanga kupiga makofi sana alafu ni mtu wa Mungu sana so ndio hiyo okay so utai so that's for the first kick eh mhm wewe hii tutapata kick hii kienda yenda lakini ni venye ni slow ikienda yenda maybe na huko mbele eh naweza scratch eh sasa unajua utakuwa una scratch katikati ya naweza scratch ya Mr President Eh. Hey. <laughs> Kali sana. Eh? Noma sana bro. No eh? Nimepata job hapo. Hapo <laughs> umepata job eh? So unataka kuchukua job yangu? Ah, uh, tutafanya na mara, tutafanya in tans. In tans eh? Leo ukifanya? Kali sana. DJ Euphoric. Eh, hapo kemo kuniletwa ni reta aje. Na tuangalie theory na practical bro. Uongo hata chuo kemo kunafunzo wa practical. Unajua unajaribu kunionga. <laughs> Sasa Ah nimekupatia ndio mm. next time ujue utaswa ngoende 6. Boom. Hiyo <laughs> ni nakuanga ki life. Eh. Yeah. DJ Euphoric is evidence that passion and humility will take you to the top. Through his journey, he has demonstrated that the only limits that exist are those in your mind and that truly sky is the limit. Thank you for watching to Zidina Hustle. I'm Martin Kemathi.